Yo, what is up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel and today we have the first review of FIFA 22. So today we are taking a look at Andre Silver, uh, Andre Silva, sorry, my bad, wants to watch. So we're looking at a card that is six foot one, medium, medium work rates, right footed, four star skill moves with a three star weak foot. So uh, if you look to the right, I have played a couple of games with him, all div rivals. He is very, very good in the box. He is kind of slow. Um, dribbling, I'm not really sure how to feel about his dribbling yet. Um, I definitely, definitely really, really like his strength. The amount of times he's just bodied people off the ball is just is ridiculous. But yeah, we're taking a look at a car that has 74 pace. So he's got 77 acceleration with a 71 sprint speed. I am happy that the uh, acceleration is higher than the sprint speed by a decent amount. Shooting stats on here are pretty nice. He's got 87 attack and positioning, 87 finishing, 83 shot power, 84 volleys, and 90 pens. Passing stats on here are decent. 79 short passing is good enough. Um, dribbling stats. The dribbling outside of agility and balance is actually pretty good. Um, I, that's really much all I have to say. Physical stats on here. He's got 88 jumping and 86 heading accuracy. And this year, jumping and like heading the ball is definitely a bit more like it's definitely more important than it was last year at least stamina 79 is actually pretty good 76 strength is really good as well and 75 for aggression is really nice as well okay i think i was talking a bit too close to the camera anyway in terms of trace he's got the flare tray but yeah man overall i played a couple of games with him man this is the squad um you guys probably are like you're probably a bit confused as to why my team is like so good i didn't spend any fifa points but the thing is um See, I was supposed to upload a video because I made like a FIFA 22 is here video, but like I got really lazy and forgot to upload it. So that's on me. But anyway, we're going to hop into a couple of games with him. Uh, we'll play some Div Rivals. I think I'm in Div 7 right now. Wait, let me just, let me check. I think I'm in Div 7. Uh, yeah, I'm in Div 7 right now. Um, we've played 29 games, so. Yeah, but yeah, man, we'll hop into a couple of games with him and see how he does. All right, guys, first game of the day. Coming up against a very, very nice team. Um, yeah, man, it looks like a pretty decent, pretty solid uh, Prem team. They've got Bernardo Silva, who's finally a cam. I don't know why he's been... Oh, wait, no. why is my trainer on? But yeah, man, hopefully Silva can do well. That would be nice. Because this year, it, the strikers oh Andres, that's what i'm talking about right there that was some really nice strength and a solid pass to Zhao, who plays into korea but yeah let's go korea's first goal nice but anyway as i was saying because this year's strikers it's a lot more important to have the four star weak foot because shooting is definitely the most important aspect for strikers this year oh what oh yeah she's actually done today I don't know why he did that, but... All right, let's go, Andre. Oh, lucky that. Yeah, you're, I don't think you're going to be outpacing a lot of center backs. What? How has that gone through? Doesn't Bernardo Silva have, like... Bro, 76 shooting and 3-star weak foot, bro. Come on. What? There, there's really nothing I can do there. That animation... Why did he, like, tackle from the side? That was so weird, man. Oh, okay. Come on. Guys, I, I accidentally stopped recording for a bit. But what? How was that a pen? I literally pr pressed the pass button. Oh my god, bro. That, that was a really dumb pen. Yeah, that did not deserve a goal. Go, Andre. See that pace. I'm actually, like, generally thinking about trying him as, like, a number 10. Uh, see that that's annoying man that's happened a, a couple of times this year like or not this year it's been like the game came out yesterday but like the animations sometimes are kind of dumb look at the link up play ah 
Finish. Oh, lucky. Finesse shots in the box, guys. I don't think they're as, like, good as they were last year. Oh, my God. Lovely. Okay. Oh, lovely. I don't even know where the ball is at. Andre muscles off. Oh, what a finish, bro. Let's go. See, that's what I'm saying. That strength. I don't even know who that defender was. He completely bodied him, bro. I probably shouldn't be trying long shots with him, considering he has like 78 long shots. Oh, bro. And crosses this year. I don't know if that's like three star weak foot or something. All right. So that was the first game. Uh, Andre Silva played decent. I don't know, guys. I Look, I, I have to say this game is better. It's definitely, I think at least it's definitely better than FIFA 21. But that's not really a compliment if we're being 100% honest. Like, it's not like the bar is very high. But I just, I don't know, man. Some things are just rubbing me the wrong way. Like, initially, when the game first came out, I was like, okay, it's not bad, right? Because I wasn't noticing too many, uh, like, bad things with it. But recently, I've just noticed there are a couple of things that are really just pissing me off. But, you know, it is what it is. Um... We'll hop into the second game with him and see how he does. Oh my god, boys, we're coming up again. This is the last team of the day. I mean, his name is Scripted Game. I couldn't agree more, but I, I don't, I'm not sure if I'm going to be winning this one, boys. If we win this one and then we tied and lost the other one, I think. or we, I know we definitely lost something, right? We lost one at least, but if we win this... I don't even understand, bro. I'm pretty sure I'm just really... If we win this, I'm probably just like the most inconsistent FIFA player ever. Oh, what? What am I supposed to do there? That touch was horrendous. And I wasn't even sprinting or anything. Lovely. Andre Silva. Oh, that's a fantastic goal right there. The drag back there working like perfectly. The keeper comes out for some reason. Yeah, I'm also really happy this year when people just like drag out their keeper for no reason. It's not as like effective as it was last year. So that's good. Let's go. Great pass there to Zhao. Put it back to... What? Oh my... I literally said play it back to Silva. Oh. Ah, oh, come on. Unlucky there. Come on, man. This game, bro. Kunku, keep going back, folks, please. Let's go. Andre Silva with a perfect cross. And Kunku with a finish. Like, we definitely deserve to be leading. He does have 69 defending. Let's go. Beautiful. Actually, perfect right there. I was tempted to shoot. Yeah, there was no way I was going to squeeze that from that angle. Unless he has, like, the ability to shrink the ball or something. There was no way that was going to work. Beautiful stuff. Look at that strength right there. But then he does everything else like at two miles per hour. That sprint boost thing right there, if you time it right. Oh my God. Oh my God, that worked perfectly. Andre Silva getting the, getting the goal last minute. That's, that's what I want my number nines to be doing. You don't need to be the fastest. Oh, man, that fake shot, like, immediately worked so well there. Let's go, boys. Finally get a W on camera. Oh, my God. But yeah, man, that was the Andre Silva review. I have to say, he definitely 100% needs the upgrade. I feel like it's probably in pace. Don't get me wrong, pace is definitely not as important this year. Yeah, he had Andre Silva. Like, it's not as important this year, but it is still somewhat important, like, you know, in real life. But, um... Yeah, the shooting inside the box is phenomenal, man. Especially with the Hunter giving him, I'm pretty sure, like 99 finishing or something. So, very, very happy with his performance today. Um, so, I will be giving him a... I think I'm going to have to give him a 6 out of 10, boys. Now, I know that's pretty low, but I'm not, I'm not sure, man. 
he was all right. Nothing like fantastic, if I'm being 100% honest. His shooting inside the box, I definitely trust him 100%. He will stay in my my team. Um, now, in terms of the ones to watch, the the reason you guys that anyone completes these cards really, apart from sentimental values, the upgrades, right? So now, what from what I've been gathering, I'm not going to pretend like I'm the biggest RB Leipzig fan. I, I haven't watched too much of Bundesliga outside of Bayern. Um, but from what I've been gathering, gathering, sorry, at least from footbin comments. Yeah, I know that's a great source. But from what I've been gathering, um, apparently they don't think that um, he's going to do too well. Apparently he has one goal in three games. I think that's decent, actually. Like one goal in three games is definitely not bad. So, um, yeah, and apparently Leipzig aren't doing the best this season. So hopefully they can pick up the form, you know, that would be nice. But yeah, that was the Andre Silva review. Thank you guys for watching. Um, if this video helped you out in any shape or form, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I've been your host, Gameplay Extra. And until next time, guys, I'm out. Peace.